was you. Hmm. You're the hero. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Gemma. No, I'm not leaving you here. That's ridiculous. We need a new plan. No, we're not discussing it, okay? You're taking it. End of story. I couldn't live if you didn't. Well, I feel the same way. There has to be another way. You're taking why, it. Why would you make me do this? You're my best friend in the world. Yeah, and you're more than that, Gemma. <sighs> I couldn't find the courage to tell you. So please. Let me show you. It's okay. Gemma. Gemma. Gemma, we have to hurry up. No. No. Take it, Gemma. No. Take it. No. Take it. I think I didn't look for dirt on him. I did. And there's nothing. I can't hate him. He's great. Why else would you fall for him? He did everything right. And you dove through a hole in the universe for me. I just want to help our friends. I know. Sorry. Uh, sorry. I know everything's well and starting over. I didn't mean to push too fast. Too fast? Fitz, it's been ten years. We can't waste any more time. Really? Because I thought that... Really? And since we're cursed or whatever nonsense... Oh, I said that one time. Well, you and, and for the record, actually, today is more evidence that the cosmos is against us. I'm tired of seeing our friends ripped apart from each other. That can't happen to us again. I won't let it. Then we won't let it. Who needs space? Because I've got something magnificent right here. <laughs> A picture of space. <laughs> One of my prized possessions, that is. And I don't know why that okay. makes significance to me. Mm -hmm. Gemma? Where have you been? Looking for you. Oh, well, I've been here at the rendezvous point, like we discussed. What, well, Mac? In the Quinjet, unloading equipment. Well, I've got a lot to talk about. Gemma. Yeah. Your hands are freezing. <laughs> oh, they. Oh. They're like little ice buckets, aren't they? <laughs> Do you think you can brave it? I'll do my best to power through.
know one of the upsides of having a girlfriend is you get to talk about what's bothering you. Yeah, well, doesn't really sound like an upside for the girlfriend. I know you're upset about Ada. I'm in a strange position. I don't want to intrude on you while you're processing. But I also want you to know you can talk to me. Always. Yeah, I know. Just, uh, you know, I go all quiet when I'm processing. Okay. It's why I fell in love with you. Who you really are, that's not programming. It's something way beyond that. That's it. Jim. You're the best. I, uh, mm. doesn't matter. I don't know about you, but I could really use a drink right about now. I'm just happy for some alone time. Okay, so not exactly like a blind car. Maybe Deke's father will have some more information we can use. Until then, we are on our own. I guess we are. What happens if this dimension expands beyond the lighthouse? What if we've come all this way back and we can't stop it? Or what if we fall to a world? You know, the only thing that I truly fear is a life without you, and that's never going to happen. Do you promise? I promise. Okay. Now, by the powers vested in me by, well, by the two of you. I'm so happy to pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. <laughs> so what about you? Bride or groom? Yeah, I mean, to be honest, I don't really know either one of them. We both know what it's like to be pulled into a strange world. Plus, he has exquisite taste in wedding rings. Can you believe that we're married? Wife. <laughs> I cannot, husband. Do you think we'll ever get used to it, husband? No, I do not, wife. Hey, I was thinking, we should hyphenate our last name, yeah? Uh, yeah. Of course. Mr. and Mrs. Simmons Fitz. <laughs> Sounds great. Just yeah. rolls right off the tongue. Yeah, right off. I'm sorry you never got the honeymoon you dreamed of. Nonsense. I'm protecting England from evil robots with the man I love. realized the universe can't stop us because we've survived the bottom of the Atlantic we've crossed the galaxy more than once <laughs> just to be together so a love like that stronger than any curse and you and I we are We're unstoppable, unstoppable together <laughs> <laughs> Yeah.
Yeah, which is why I can't live another day without you. So I'm asking you, heart in hand. Gemma Simmons, will you marry me? Absolutely. <laughs> I have to admit, right now here with you, I don't give a damn if we ever escape. Do that. Okay, good to go. We're on the clock now. Gemma, for us, it will be an instant. 